What up, everybody? It's Richard, owner of Cutting Up Lawn Care and Development. Cutting up one yard at a time. Um, I'm on here doing an aeration for a client with a 25 spleen class and aerator. But the purpose of this video is to show you how to start a legal business in 2021. And so here we go. So the first thing you want to do is pick a business name and then you want to go to the Secretary of State or you can do like I did and go to LegalZoom and get you an LLC, Limited Liability Company, get you an LLC. Then after that, you want to go to IRS.gov and get you an EIN number, Employee Identification Number. Yeah, so you can definitely go to IRS.gov and uh, go to the search box and put um, how to apply for EIN, which is the employee identification number. Um, how to apply for EIN, and then you can go to. Uh, attention to the hours of operation because these are the times that you can go online and get your EIN online. You can apply, hit apply online now. Right now you're not going to be able to do it because it's after hours, but you can definitely do that during business hours. It takes like five to ten minutes and you will get your EIN in a letter sent to your email. And you can go to the next step. After you completed that step, you want to go to your tax assessor's office in the county that you live in and go and get you a business license. I believe it's like $30 to $60 a year, but go ahead and get you a business license so you're legally able to do business um, in the county that you're in. After that, you want to go to any bank and go and get you a business checking account. Um, you can do checking and savings, but get you a business checking account so everything that you do through your business, it goes through that checking account and it's easier on you when you do taxes. All right. The next step is very important. After you get your business account, you want to definitely go and get general liability insurance. Um, it's going to be fun out there cutting grass and making money, but at some point you're going to damage or break somebody's property. Pro property. Probably going to break a glass or something. We've all done it. And you definitely want to make sure you are insured. Next, uh, this is the last step. You want to get you a social media presence. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, TikTok. And then get you a YouTube channel so people can see the work and see what you do out there and hire you and you can get more clients that way. So I hope these steps help you in um, starting your business. Have fun out there and I'll see you out there.